everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to set up an invoice using the virtual terminal. So we're going to go ahead and click the virtual terminal button here from the Clover dashboard. And then right here under transaction type, we're going to do the drop down menu and select invoice. From here, you can go ahead and set up the invoice amount. So let's say it's $100. You'll go ahead and input that. And as you can tell here, a really cool feature is that it already calculates tax. So this is the default tax setting. You can also take off the tax if it's not taxable, or you can also select a different tax option depending on what you need for your particular invoice item. Here you can uh, add a note or add the item name, what it is, whatever it is that you're charging them for. So we'll just click test here. And a really cool option too is let's say you're invoicing a client for a service. Let's say, let's say you are a makeup artist and you charge the client $100 and they want to go ahead and add you a tip of $25. So you can go ahead and add that into the invoice as well. Right here. And you'll see that it calculates right here at the bottom. The total is $133 with 65 cents. Then right here, you would go ahead and either search the customer name if you have already helped them before, invoiced them before, or you could click to add a new customer and input all of their details here. So that'll save. And it'll show who you sent it to, the date it's scheduled for, and the total amount. Once you have all of that information input, this right here will go ahead and turn green, and that says create invoice, and you'll be able to create your invoice for your customer. That's it for how to create an invoice using your Clover virtual terminal. If you have any questions or if you have any suggestions on any of the other videos we should make coming up, please leave us a comment down below. Please like this video and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Thank you.